Massacre is a short horror film with some slasher elements. It's going to be very bloody. Basically what happens is a girl, Marianne, wakes up at the site of a very grisly mass murder and can't remember what happens. Andy and I had just gotten off of doing a project together which was a horror feature film called Ditch Day Massacre. And lo and behold, Pandy presented uh, this awesome original uh, script um, for her short film, Massacre. I have always found that horror films have a tendency to appeal to more of a, of a male-driven audience. And I myself, as a director, has tried to put more of a... I don't know if feminine touches is, is the word, but more of a, a, an incentive for females to be drawn to some of the characters or the situations within horror films. And I think that pieces, horror films that are written by a female writer have a tendency to uh, reach out a little bit more towards a female audience, whether they do this intentionally or unintentionally, it seems to kind of happen. And I think that this film does a great job at doing that. I'm expecting that viewers of this film, I think people who really like the horror genre and who like slasher flicks, who like you know violence and blood, are really, really going to like this. I mean, other people will hopefully like it too, but it's really geared towards, I think, the quintessential slasher horror horror lover. I think it's really, it's really a special little film just for them. Working with Joe Hendrick was really cool. Um, I feel like he's someone who really understands the genre of horror and especially kind of like the slasher type flick. So. I don't know, there was a scene, a very bloody and violent scene in Ditch Day Massacre that we worked on together um, where he was directing me and it was physically a very demanding scene and it was, it called for a lot of emotion and there was a lot of violence and it was, you know, he, the things he said and the way he directed, it just really helped pull the, that performance out of me, like the, the violent, like, you know, I was the victim in this in this particular scene and really, you know, escaping from the psycho with the axe. It was just a very difficult scene and I feel like he just really, really helped me bring that out. Bring out the inner victim of an axe wielding maniac <laughs> inside. So it was pretty awesome to work with him and I'm excited to work with him again. I've worked in a lot of movies through the years. I've also done short films, music videos, commercials. I have an extensive knowledge of uh, producing I've had the opportunity to work on feature films such as uh, Instructions Not Included, uh, Smiley, which was another horror movie, and other independent movies um, like Water and Power and Road to Juarez. I'm very excited to be part of this project because of the talent that's involved in it, uh, director Joe Hendrick and Pandy's Suicide. Um, the reason why I was interested in this project is because I uh, really like horror movies and I'm all about bringing quality into the screen. This is an international project. Uh, we're also thinking about involving other people from other countries. Yeah. Um, there's uh, DPs, production designers, etc. So I think that you know, bringing the different flavors from the different parts of the world is going to really make this project a unique one. I'm originally from New Zealand. I moved here to Los Angeles about five years ago. And also, Michelle is from Mexico. Yeah, I'm from Mexico, so for everybody out there in Mexico that wants to donate, hey, you're also supporting our, our culture and our uh, people. And so is uh, everybody from New, New Zealand. Zealand. Yeah. Well, this is a, a project that A, you're going to see, for any horror fans out there, they are going to see something that they have never seen before uh, with horror. And they're also shedding light on a whole new group of, of filmmakers. It's kind of a, a whole new generation of, of horror filmmakers. We have a lot of great little incentives going. Um, we have an executive producer's credit. We have uh, signed prints of uh, a photo by Chris Jan Lim, who's a great horror photographer. You know, we're going to thank everybody on the Facebook and the Twitter who who uh, gives some money towards the film. We have all kinds of great incentives, uh, one-of-a-kind Polaroids or Instax photos. We have 
We even have a little role in the film where if you can get yourself to LA or are in LA and can transport yourself to the, to the set, we will have you have a small line and you will get massacred and our film Massacre would be pretty awesome.